This video segment relates to the diffuse decreased parenchymal echogenicity of the supreme. From both angles, as we see a starry liver in the same way, these bright tiny echogenic areas looking as stars behind a black background are the vessel radicals within the subplanic parenchyma just as you see in the liver so this is when you see these vascular radicals are not seen in normal subplane and nor in the liver now this is a ditocopy of uh, toxic liver that you have been seeing and it al always appears when the echogenicity of the spleen has gone down because of any infective process. Yeah, this is this bright area, this one, this one, this one, this, all these bright, tiny, shiny areas are uh, leading to three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. So there are so many echogenic areas, tiny. They are actually the, they are representative of. Uh, vascular radicals, this is the spleen, this is the spleen, and this is the spleen from other view. Okay. Now, this is the splenic vein, this is the hilar region, this is the hilar region, this is the diaphragm, left diaphragm. So this is a short case study of diffuse decreased parenchymal echogenicity of the kidney. Focus. No, sorry, uh, diffuse decreased parenchymal echogenicity of the spleen that is also giving a starry appearance. This always occurs in infective processes. You see it again. See the count the countless echogenicities are seen. This is one of them. This is second. This is third. This is fourth. Fifth. Excessive. A lot of the outer surface of the spleen is smooth. Now just see the degree of vascular prominence in this spleen which is giving it a starry appearance toxic this is a magnified view of the spleen see it now this is all spleen magnified central region and these are the prominent vascular radicals seen throughout scattered throughout the subclinic parenchyma how much they are prominent, how much they are in number you see, depends on the degree of congestion of the spleen, the degree of fluid in the spleen because of infective material, exudate. So this was from other view and this is the normal view. There is no evidence of pleural diffusion. However, classic starry appearance of the spleen, which is normal in dimension. 
measures 11.1 cm normal should not exceed more than 12 cm